<clears throat> it is 9.19 in the morning. I went to bed last night. <clears throat> the power kept going out, which kept me up most, like, I wasn't, I didn't sleep well last night because the power kept going out and people kept waking me up. Bernie wasn't home, so they all wanted to be in the, in the room with me in the bed. Girl, they all in the room with me. I'm starving. I stopped at McDonald's and got me a um, steak, egg, and cheese bagel. Hold the breakfast sauce because I don't know what the heck is in that. Extra onion. I hope my voice will come back. But I left the house at at 5. Because I was like, well, I'm up now. Doesn't seem like I'm going to get any more sleep. <clears throat> so I brought my computer. I was like, I can just do some editing in the car. Edit some TikToks. My voice sounds crazy. It was like, I can edit some TikToks and like be productive. I was going to get coffee. The whole thing. I got to that Walmart parking lot. <clears throat> First of all, it's 20 some degrees outside. I didn't feel like going in Wawa. Because I didn't want to get out the car. Um, so I got to the Walmart parking lot. I was like, I'll just sit there because <clears throat> Walmart will be open soon and it's less lights. Like it was just very bright at Wawa and a lot more movement because people are in and out, in and out, in and out. So I went to the Walmart parking lot, y'all. <clears throat> and I fell asleep <laughs> and I slept in this car from 545 to like 845. I'm just waking up and getting myself like acclimated but yeah it was a disaster I didn't do anything I was supposed to do and then I just burned a bunch of gas because I had to keep the car running should have stayed my butt home I'm pretty sure everybody else is still asleep because it's only 9 22 and they were up all night too so I'll go home in a little while I'm gonna show y'all the night stands that I'm thinking about ordering <clears throat> and probably film some more stuff today double big mac i will buy that <laughs> <laughs> thank you you too look y'all all that means is the power went out again Look at this. <laughs> Got my water, two coffees. Somebody was eating some pizza and just decided to leave the whole plate right here. <sighs> Is there any food left from yesterday? Okay. Got a few chicken wings, a few slices of pizza. I gotta go downstairs. Can y'all hear that beeping? That is the sump pumps because the power keeps going out and they are operated by electricity. Girl. All right, let me get the our house uh, folder so I can show y'all what I ordered and I can show y'all the um, nightstands. Both of these cars need to be washed. They are absolutely disgustingly dirty. That don't even make no sense. Like, look at this. Just gross. <clears throat> Oh, let me get my other stuff out of here that I need. Oh, I need to go back to Ulta too. I keep forgetting about that. I got a couple returns. I meant to do it yesterday, but then I forgot to um to bring the stuff I need to I needed to return. Alright, 
so y'all i got another freaking catalog i saw this couch in the store and look at that friendly uh coffee table so cute that's that's really really pretty okay um here's my folder because definitely did not intend to go in there and spend any money i was just looking to see what they had but i don't need to be in that store because i don't have any self-control when it comes to our house i love that store i'm thinking about ordering two more things from okay first of all this is what i bought i bought the jagger office chair because you're a girl if you were already a fan of the jagger uh dining chairs and the jagger what is it called uh counter stools you already know this is such a cute um piece but i just love the fact that it's in a desk chair and it's it swivels but it doesn't roll so it's perfect for me to put in my bathroom just to get in and out of the chair really quickly and it's like a charcoal color mm -hmm. so i was like let me go ahead and order it because i didn't know how long it would be in stock um because apparently it's kind of hard to come by so i was like let me just go ahead and order it right now <laughs> so i don't miss out on it that was my coach bag money because I was going to order me a new um, coach bag. I wanted the, what's it called? The tabby quilted pillow bag, but I'd rather have this chair. So I got the chair and yeah, got it for in-store pickup <clears throat> and that will be ready. She said it should be there on the 7th. Today is the, what's today? What is today? Good Lord. Um... But it'll be ready on February 7th. I can go pick it up, which I probably won't pick it up on the same day. I'll probably pick it up on the weekend because I need Bernie to come with me. Um, the only thing is, if you do in-store pickup, you, you are not eligible to do any sort of protection plan. You forego that. You just have to inspect it before you leave the store. I was like, how am I going to inspect it if it's in a box? <laughs> she was like, well, maybe you can just take it out the box a little bit and see how it looks. I was like, all right, cool. Because it's not super duper expensive. You would think, you know, compared to some of the other stuff, it's not extremely expensive. Um, so here are what I'm planning on using as nightstands. This is the Finley, the Finley Hall chest. So I think I'm going to order two of these for our coffee table. I'm sorry, as nightstands in our room. You open up the cabinet and then they have shelves inside. Because we need really grand nightstands we need grand furniture to go beside our bed because our bed is huge and tall and we have a lot of space because our room is so big we have a lot of space on either side of the bed so we need something kind of big so i like the i really really like the um this chest and i'm gonna get it in the black almost black color with the white marble top and the top is so pretty it has like sparkles in it in addition to the veining inside the mar the marble, it also has like these flecks of like sparkles, like glittery, not glitter, cause it's not, that's not a good word to use, but it has these really sparkly flecks, it's so pretty. Um, so I think I'm gonna order that. And then the last thing that I'm also thinking of adding to the order is, let me find it. The Keegan couch. For our bedroom i really want to get our bedroom finished but this is what it looks like very modern still has those square arms y'all know i like square arms like modern uh straight clean lines i don't like rolled arms and like really skinny arms on my on my furniture um so i really really like this one what i'm thinking is that i'm going to get a left arm and then i can either get a corner piece which looks like this or I can get a right arm um, which is the same price as the left arm so we can do left and right arm or we can do left arm corner if you get the corner piece then it has it's it's taller on the side and then it comes with this extra pillow right here which gives you like more space to sink into and then I'm gonna get the ottoman and that will be the three pieces that we'll order I'm still kind of deciding. I'm not 100% sure about whether or not this is going to be the couch, but I really, really like it. And I want Bernie to go and sit on it and see what he thinks. Because honestly, he's probably going to use it more than me. I don't know. We'll see. 
um maybe when i when i have a couch i want to sit in my room more <laughs> that's probably what's gonna happen i'm probably gonna end up spending a lot more time in my room once we have a couch there and just like hanging out watching tv because it's really not comfortable to sit in my room and watch tv right now unless i'm in a bed so yeah so that is called again the keegan um so yeah that is that's what i'm thinking about ordering i need to get another um zero percent interest credit card because the one i have right now is about to we're about to be finished with our introductory period and i don't remember how much time i have left i need to call the bank and figure out or call the credit card company and figure out uh how much time we have left on that introductory rate because one thing I will not be doing is putting it on a card that don't have a 0% interest introductory rate um, or a 0% interest rate so I can pay it back without interest. So this is gonna be a, one of the more major purchases and it's gonna take me a few months probably to pay it off and I don't wanna, um, I'm not going to be paying interest. I would rather just buy one piece at a time than pay interest. The problem with that is that if you buy one piece at a time, then you got to pay shipping for every piece. And it's like $300 for delivery. So that's why I do not do that. That's why I do larger um, orders. And then I just, you know, spend, basically stop buying everything else and just pay it off. And usually it only takes me like three months max to get it paid off. So <clears throat> that's, that's the plan unless I find something else. I don't want to rush into it because I haven't even really looked at any other options recently. And this is like new. So I think other places may be coming out with new furniture too. But this is another iteration. So yeah, if you're a fan of the Finley stuff, it's really nice. Oh, and then we thought, we talked about this to be used as a dresser in my room. It's a buffet. What's the... I can't remember what it's called. Uh, these are the Jagger dining chairs. I'm sure y'all have seen these a million times in people's houses because everybody has them. But um, let me see. Flore sideboard. So you can get that. It has the fluting. So it looks a lot like this over here. It's very similar to this piece that in that it has like that fluting on it. But since it will be in my bedroom, it's not, you know, there's really no correlation between the two. But also the Finley has the fluting. So it's kind of playing off that aspect of the Finley um, little chest. And it's, I think it's the same color. And then it has a marble top that is inset. So it's like kind of in there a little bit. It's not sitting on top, it's down inside of it. And you can get it either in white or black, but it's Carrera marble, which I'm not a fan of, especially up against the marble that it that comes with the um, Finley because it has more warmth to it. The Finley has like a little bit of beige veining going through it and it has some a little bit of gray veining going through it but it's mostly like a creamy color so i feel like it's clashing if i do white marble on this if i were to get this um i'm not sold on this buffet at all i think what i might do is look on rh and see if i can find maybe a plain black um a plain black one Oh, here's the Finley coffee table, another Finley coffee table in round, and then a Finley sideboard. So there's quite a bit of stuff in the Finley collection, but, and here's the color I will be getting. So here's the dining table. Look how pretty. And then here's the sideboard in the um, ebony color, which is a really, really, really dark brown, has the brass, um, fixtures and legs and then the white top which I absolutely love I've been looking at this for almost a year so I've been that's been my top choice for almost a year so I don't think I'm gonna find anything better here's the Finley bed look at how pretty this is y'all if I had seen this before I ordered my bed I probably would have got this 
um, but I'm glad I didn't because my bed was very affordable. <laughs> um, and here's the Finley dresser, which I don't really want the Finley dresser because I don't want it to be that matchy matchy. I'm not, I don't like matchy matchy. It's pretty though. It's really, really pretty. What's the size? It is not telling me what the dimensions are for it. All right. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm thinking about ordering. I'm not doing it today, not doing it tomorrow. I need some time to think about it and really like hone in on what I want. But also um, what I was saying is I think I might order a, just a plain black nightstand from RH because, I'm sorry, a plain black dresser because they have larger dresser options. Um, and I can do like a wider dresser and then I wanna do a mirror in the corner. <sighs> so. If you're in home decor land too, <laughs> drop a comment and tell me your favorite home decor piece that you, like your dream home decor piece that you are thinking about getting and you haven't hit, you haven't actually purchased it yet or you just purchased it or something you already have in your house. Like what's your favorite home decor piece? Drop it in the comments. I swear every time my kids touch anything, it ends up broke. This, look at this. just hanging uh, all i did was gave it to him and told him to put it in my office that was it that's they touched it for like two minutes for no nope, probably like 30 seconds and this is what happened so now i gotta figure out if i can get another one of these oh okay wait this is type c to i don't know what the heck this is i'm gonna have to see if i can order another one of these cords so i don't have to order the whole tripod all over again because that's what it goes to um so annoying good lord man Stuff they don't tell you about having kids is they break everything that you have. Everything that you've ever thought about owning in your life. They gonna break it. They gonna break it. Okay. Um, I'm gonna see if I can go on Amazon and buy another one of this. I'm sure I can. It's just a matter of figuring out what it's called. Because <laughs> I have no idea what this, what this piece is called. I know what this one is called. It's type C. But I don't know what this one is. But obviously it's not working. But it's not effect it's not affecting um the tripod at all. It's just making these buttons inoperable because you're supposed to be able to, you know, turn the camera on with this tripod, record with it, and then this one is like um taking pictures and then I think that's what that's for. And then this one is how you zoom in and out. So without this cable, I cannot use any of these buttons because there's no way to connect the camera to the tripod to have them communicate with each other. Um, but yeah, so I will look for another one of this. Maybe I can take a picture of it and do a little, um, like reverse look up. That's probably a good idea. But I also have a new tripod, which I need to order. I mean, which I need to open to use for this video. And the brand is Torgem. And we done did two tripod unboxings in three days, Lord. Uh -oh. And we have yet another Bluetooth remote. And yet another cell phone attachment. Get your phone in this part. And then we have our main tripod. So obviously, Camera is going to go on this tripod. Cell phone is going to go on the smaller tripod. <clears throat> so basically you just screw your camera onto here. The camera, every camera comes with this little screw part on the bottom. So you can go ahead and screw that in. And before I start cleaning, let me show y'all what I got from Sephora and Ulta because I just remember I never did show y'all that. Um, so from Sephora, this was quick because I only got one thing from each. <laughs> but from Sephora, I got this fulvic acid brightening cleaner, cleanser. This was, I think this is my second time getting this. If it's, this is the one I'm thinking about, then I've had this before and I liked it. Um, I'm going to take back the Good Molecules cleanser because I don't like that. And then uh, from Ulta, I just got some black girl sunscreen because the good molecules one is a no for me it's very 
it balls up on my skin and it just it has a white cast and I just don't like it at all. And that's it. That's it for my little skincare haul because I did a huge thing, a bigger skincare haul um, a few days ago. So I didn't really need much. I'm over it. All right, y'all. I'll see y'all in a bit. Take it away, take it away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love. I've been trying to forget, but you won't let me. Something in my brain wants you. I've been hanging by myself. Maybe a break, boy, you're my weakness. Giving we take the love that we make. It's my favorite drug. Too caught up in your love. I've been trying to forget, but you won't let me. Something in my brain holds you. I've been hanging by myself, asking for help, but nothing seems to work on you. While I'm waiting for the video to edit, I'm just cleaning out the air fryer. Because, for some reason, some people will not put a liner in it. I don't care what they put. If it's, I don't care if they put foil, if they put um, the parchment paper, liners. Just put something so it don't get gross on the inside. But yeah, so I'm just cleaning it out. And I'm about to have some lunch. I'm going to do leftover chicken wings from yesterday and some salad and cucumbers. I'm so tired. Like, all I want to do is take a nap. Plans, I got talk. Heard it's real cheap, but it's really go cost. I'm trying to get these ends. Building bios with my friends. I'm about handling my business. No time for stress over food. You think success is an option. I'm trying to get this popping like, woo. Big moves. My rules. Heavy on the tweeting, I'll disappear a whole season like, woo. Who said they looking for me? 
I'ma make you wait for it. Spend a few racks on a shopping spree. Yeah, I'ma make you pay for it. Tell them give it to me when I want it, please. Wait tight and I leg for it. Count down for me. 12, 11, 10, 9. Hate that, I'ma make you wait for it. On my time. Yeah, I'ma make you pay for it. On my time. My time, my time. Me first, you sure on my time, been off yours, boss to the floor. It's my time. You was for you, I was for us. You do the math, don't add up. Even on my worst day, down on my luck. I got the sauce, I'ma always come up. I tried it your way, that was a dub. I'm taking the wheel now, cause I trust me. I'ma go get these millions. I'm still hoping and wishing. You always had me waiting, and I'm about fresh out of patience. This time we switching positions. Now you went through my submission, like, Woo. my rules, big moves. Y'all heavy on the tweeting. I'll disappear a whole season, like, Woo. Who said they looking for me? I'ma make you wait for it. Spend a few racks on a shopping spree. Yeah, I'ma make you pay for it. Tell them give it to me when I want it, please. Wait tight and I leg for it. Count down for me. Five, four, three, two. I want, I'ma make you wait for it. for it. On my time. Yeah, I'ma make you pay for it. On my time. My time, my time. I just finished making a charcuterie board and I filmed a TikTok for it, but I didn't get a chance to um, pull out my camera because I'm using the memory cards to get videos so I can upload them um, and organize my videos for next week. But this is how it turned out. Really cute. I'm gonna take a um, picture of it for the thumbnail, I think. And I'm about to finish up my wings, have some lunch. And I'm probably gonna be chilling the rest of the day just getting my footage uploaded. Y'all are not gonna believe this. I was about to um, end the video with like a cute little make a bubble bath uh, montage. But oh, we need, we need lights. The daggone um, hot water heater is messing up Ow. again. Yes, Corey. Look, look, look how <sighs> Good job, girlfriend. Did you get all the ornaments? All right. Hot water heater messing up again. So we don't have no hot water. I think he about to try to clean the... Um, flame sensor or whatever it's called and then we'll go from there but i am tired i was looking forward to taking a bubble bath but um yeah so i'm about over it they need to come out here and fix this because i cannot deal i'm about to just go to sleep and we try again tomorrow we'll see if he is able to fix it your father oh he said you were excellent Excellent. Bye, Corey. <laughs> Anyways, all right, y'all. I will see y'all in the next video. Thank you for watching. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed the video. Bye. Say bye. Bye. You don't need to. <laughs>